We've already showed you the first three chords. A, D, and E. And back to A. What I'd like to do now is to show you another three chords. We're going to start off with C, the chord of C. For C, we put our first finger on the first fret of the second string. It's just down there. Our second finger is going to come here. That's on the second fret of the fourth string. And our third finger is going to come here, up onto the fifth string on the third fret. So that's second string, first fret, fourth string on the second fret, and the fifth string on the third fret. That's C. C. Now, if we just bring our pinky up here, up onto the third fret of the fourth string. Now we now realise that we have two fingers on the same string. There's not much point to that, because only one of them can actually affect the pitch. So when the pinky comes on, this one comes off and jumps down onto the third string. So we've gone from a C and brought our pinky on here onto that fourth string there. And as it goes down, this finger jumps onto the third string. So we get a C, an F, a C, an F, a C. That's your C and your F. Pinky on and the second finger jumping down onto the third string. And finally, a G chord. And for the G, we bring these two fingers down so they're on the third fret of the first and second string. So our little pinky is down here, on the third fret of the first string. Our second finger is on the third fret of the second string. This finger here, which is really our first finger, because we've got one, two, three, and four. First finger is on the second fret of the fifth string. And the second finger is on the third fret of the sixth string. And that's our G. And we can move around those chords like this. C. F. G, F, C, F, G, F, C, F, G, F, C. And one more time, there's our C chord. This finger, this one, and this one. C. For the F, bring your pinky on here, straight underneath that one, the third fret and the fourth string. Make your second finger jump across, so it's on the third string on the second fret. That's your F, and for your G, bring these two, your fourth and fifth fingers down onto the first and second strings. Down here, bang the guitar in the process, and these two up to the top. First finger, second fret of the fifth string, third finger, third fret of the sixth string. C. F. G. F. C. So by now you have A, D, and E, and you have C. F and G. Okay, good luck.